Now let's see what overfitting is. Overfitting occurs when a machine learning model learns the training data too well, capturing no noise or random fluctuations instead of the underlying patterns. Uh, now let's look into the example. Imagine you are uh, studying for a test and memorize the exact wording of every question and answer in your textbook. When the test comes with slightly different questions, you might struggle because you haven't truly understood the concepts. That's like overfitting in machine learning. Memorizing the training data without grasping the underlying patterns. Now let's look into the consequences. Just like our students struggling on the test, an overfitted model fails to generalize well to real world situations. It performs exceptionally well on the training data, but poorly on naive, unseen data. This can lead to inaccurate predictions and decreased model reliability. So the solution is to combat overfitting, we employ techniques like cross-validation. So this is called overfitting because it has captured the random patterns and noise of the training data and it hasn't been able to generalize the, uh, you know, the facts. So this is a problem and we can solve it by class uh, you know we can solve it by cross validation so cross validation means we will divide in the uh, you know uh, data set into multiple training and validation sets and we will uh, conduct uh, multiple uh, tests on the model uh, on the training data and then we will match um, we'll evaluate the training data on the validation sets uh, so that we can pay well the performance. If the performance is consistent, we can say, well, yeah, it's good to go. So uh, the, uh, we'll see whether the uh, model is consistent on the training data and it can, <clears throat> uh, you know, do what it's supposed to do. So that's it. So thank you very much.